so we're at church this morning. We're at my sister's church because they're doing a baby dedication for my nephew Elias. And basically what they do is they go up in front of the church and they say, um, you know, we commit to raising our child in the church. And so little Miss here is going to go in class with her cousin Emmy and play. And Alex and I are going to go <laughs> are going to go into the service and we're going to see Elias be dedicated this morning. Well, good morning. Twice a year, we get the pleasure of having um, a baby dedication service at the beginning of the service. And our blessing is, may the Spirit of Yahweh fill you from your youth. May you proclaim His name in this world. May you be set apart and changed by the world around you. Yet always seeking the opportunity to change the world for Him. Did you have fun at church? Yeah. Yeah, what did you do? Colored and did you sing songs? No, I just colored. No, no, just colored. What she did said, you eat? Um, donuts. A donut. She said I had one donut and Emmy had two donuts and then there were no more donuts. So I think everybody must have got one of the donut. Got a donut. She did this little drawing. So pretty. Looks great. And now we're gonna go eat. Wanna go to eat lunch? We're at Wendy's. The girls wanted chicken and fries. <laughs> okay, so we had to stop into Walmart, and of course we got to stop and see the fishies. Look at the shiny tassels. Like, They're know, so know, shiny. Know. Oh, they are shiny. Oh, hello, Mr. Catfish. Mama. They're very shiny. I squished it. What? Yeah. There's some more squishing and some more squishing. Some more squishing? <laughs> You're so funny. Yeah, I like those. Those are really pretty. The shiny with the... Spots, they look like. Are they catfish? Yeah, I think so. Pick this cat. Pick this cat. Pick this cat. Pick this cat. Are you done? Yeah. Are you sure? I'm going to leave the blinds closed. You're going to leave the blinds closed? Yeah. So lately, Miss Chelsea has been tired. The last two nights, we were off schedule. I'm eating dinner. We were off schedule because we went out for ice cream Friday night and then last night she took a nap. She fell asleep on the, in the car on the way home. So she went to bed late last night. So she's been crabby all day. And lately what we've been doing is when Chelsea gets crabby during the day is telling her to go lay in her bed and she can get up when she quits being crabby. So Chelsea was just really crabby because she's tired. So I said, let's go lay down until you feel better, which was like two minutes ago. So she just got up. Are you better now? No more crabbiness? No. It's kind of almost like a little reset button for her. It seems like once she realizes, okay, well, I have to lay here until I'm stopped being crabby, then she's like, oh, I'm better now. Like, I'm in a happy mood now. You in a happy mood now? You going to play and have fun and be happy? We'll see how long it lasts. <laughs> Are you super duper prepared with your two pairs of sunglasses? <laughs> Why are you barking? Why? Why? Oh. oh. <laughs> you just licked me in the face. Oh my goodness. Ow. Oh, Edward. Ouch. Ouch, what's wrong? Oh no. You're okay. Ed, quit rolling. Ed. Oh. Get over here. Look at him. He's like, I know you just sat down and you won't get up and get me. You are a turkey. <laughs> Playing hide and seek with Chelsea. Let's see if she finds me. Oh! Found you. <laughs> you found me. Good job. Your count, Mom. My turn to count? Yeah. Okay. I can hold on down. <laughs> yeah, turn. The struggle is real. She's trying to put on both pair of glasses at the same time. She did have them both on. Put them on. Put them both on at the same time so everybody can see. Upside down. The new pair of glasses is now being worn upside down. Oh my goodness. Wow. Look at all them glasses. Chelsea. <laughs> Look at mommy. Whoa. So I wanted to show you guys when we went to Walmart earlier, the girls and I did, 
Um, I found some Zoom Zooms. Okay, we went to a Walmart that we don't usually go to and I found a bunch of stuff in the toy section what? that we don't have at ours. Zoom Zooms. But those are everywhere. Not these ones. I got, I guess I could show it to you. I got Ariel. Look at the little tail. It's so cute. So I got the Ariel Zoom Zoom and then the only other little mermaid. You've already seen them, silly goose. The only other um, Little Mermaid it's one so they cute. had, it is so cute, was Sebastian. So I went ahead and got Ariel and Sebastian. I, I really want... It's got a pinch on it. It does have a pinch on it. He's got pinchers. I really want um, Flounder, I think is the other one. And then they have King... Flounder was at the or toy Target. <laughs> was he? Oh, I thought he I was. Remember seeing I thought him. Him. Oh, I don't know. Really? <laughs> I first thought Walmart, then I thought Toys R Us, then I thought Target. That was, it was a lot yes. of every store. You know what else they had is they had um, Toy Story Zoom Zooms, and I almost picked some up for Michael, but I don't know how big he is into the Zoom Zooms. I really like them. Oh my goodness! Miss! You are crazy. Look at she keeps going through my legs. <laughs> okay, so we didn't show yesterday. Candy we bought, we which I, I was kind of bought. debating. I don't know. I guess some of you saw, but it yeah, should be a surprise. But we did get the bubble. Feel it. Why is it's it like, like that? It's squishy. Bubbles I'm guessing the bubbles one. are in it. Oh, it feels like maybe it's a Ziploc pouch. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Oh. So we got three of these that I guess we'll probably do a video on. We're going to probably do a video on all these. Some of these kadunks, which I've seen commercials for these. Kadunk kadunk. <laughs> so I got two flavors to try on that. Also got, again, saw commercials for these, the ju juicy drops. Mm. So we'll do a video on those. Really? Came running. Came running to get a drink of water when he heard us vlogging. Don't Excuse mind me. us. Excuse we'll me. We'll just wait. Excuse me. Take your time. <laughs> um... I don't know, that you picked out. Oh, this is I the Lint. We, oh no, we didn't, oh man. Popcorn, what? Yeah. Squished. Sweet popcorn, popcorn flavored chocolate. I'm looking forward to that. It might have popcorn bits in it. Cry babies. Okay, well I grew up with the wax bottle. You got louder. Oh, goodness. Like a camel storing up his hump. We're trying to vlog over Oh, here. Michael, he's, he's got a leaf. trying to, he's got a leaf stuck in his nose And then Chelsea, hair. one of these. Oh, so, like, like I remember when we were kids, we used to have the candy necklaces. She picked that up. I don't know if she picked it out because it has Hello Kitty on it, or if she picked it out because of what it is, but she picked out the candy necklace. And then what else did she pick out? Something I didn't really care for her to have. I think she picked out gummies or something. Uh -huh. And I was like, well, you have to pick one or the other. Yeah. And she picked the necklace, which is fine. The only thing is, is it might be hard for her to bite the can. You know how these are kind of hard on your teeth? I don't know. Probably not the best thing for her, but got it for her anyway. So there's all the stuff that we got at Five Below. All the candy stuff that we got. Did we? Did, where did we go? He leaves while I'm vlogging. Uh, I don't think we bought anything else. Did we buy anything else at Five Below? I got a Clark Bar and that was it. Oh, Michael got Clark. <laughs> so there's what we got at Five Below yesterday and look forward to taste tests on pretty much everything we just showed you guys except for, uh, I guess I could maybe vlog Chelsea trying to eat this. So we'll see. It's time for the question of the day. Today's question comes from Arts and Crafts and Me and the question is, if you discovered a new island, what would you name it? Mine's in a book. Terabinthia from the Chronicles of Narnia. But that's already a plate. It already exists. It's made up in your book. Too bad. No, you gotta come up with your own name. Fine, the Island of Alex. <laughs> See, that was hard. Oh, well, you can't steal. Dead. You can't it already exists. Steal a name out of a book. You gotta come up with your own name because it's the island that you discovered. No. Fine, Island of Alex. Mike-topia. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, Hollytopia sounds good though. You can't That's steal not fair. You can't steal it. Well, it's not though. It's Holly. What were you gonna say? 
I was gonna say Holly Catraz, like Alcatraz. <laughs> Holly Holly Catraz. <laughs> Holly okay. Catraz. Well, because I thought Alcatraz, and maybe then people wouldn't want to come there, and I could keep the island to myself. Does that make sense? Sure. <laughs> this is hard, but I like the sound of Hollytopia. It sounds better I than. I like Holly Catraz better. Holly Catraz. Can, can I say Alexatraz? <laughs> sure. We're all gonna have a traz. Does that even no, make I'm sense? I'm with Mike Topia. Mike Topia? Yep. Dark Topia. <laughs> if you want to go with that, you can. I do. I like Holly Topia. But I don't know. This is really hard because it's like you want your name to be in it. I don't know. So I know from you guys. If you discovered a new island, what would you name it? Leave it in the comments below.